Hey guys, this is Mike from Nexus 7 Soft Modder. Today I'll be showing you how to turn your Nexus 7 into a heads up display for your car. So, we're going to be using a really cool app I discovered a few months ago. Uh, basically, you put it onto the dashboard of your car and it will reflect a display onto your windshield showing you stuff like miles per hour or uh, navigational directions. So, let's go ahead and get started and search for the Google Play Store for. Uh, Navier is how I think you pronounce it. Uh, HUD, which is short for Heads Up Display. And you should see two search results with this uh, N logo. It's developed by Wow Rain Studios. Uh, there's a free version and a paid version. Uh, we'll be using the free one for this tutorial. But if you find yourself liking the app enough, you can pay $2.99 and it'll remove all the ads. And if you have the app on multiple devices, you can sync data across those devices. So um, before I get started, uh, once you have that installed, uh, make sure you have a data connection. Uh, this app does pull GPS data from the Google Maps API. So basically it needs a data connection to function. So if you have the 3G version of the Nexus 7 with an active data plan, then you should be all set. Otherwise you can tether it to a device, uh, another device with hotspot capability. Um, since the app is meant to be used in a car, you're going to need a mobile data connection. You can't use your home Wi-Fi because you'll be driving out of its range. So, go ahead and open up the app. And you'll see uh, two choices. Uh, this classic navigation and digital dashboard. Um, let's take a look at those two. So this is for uh, navigating to a particular address. Uh, just type it into the search bar up here. And search results should uh, show up with pink pins. Uh, just tap on the one that you're intending to navigate to and this panel will show up on the right uh, planning your route and then you can just tap this uh, triangle to start navigating All right, so this um, HUD, I'll just refer to it as a HUD for the rest of the video uh, it'll show you a speedometer a compass and you notice right now it, it's showing you at 7 miles per hour uh, sometimes it does that as it's getting a GPS fix, but um, once it gets a stable GPS fix, it should even out. And uh, yeah, uh, here it'll show you where you need to turn for navigation. It's really cool. And then if you don't need to navigate anywhere, you can use this digital dashboard. It'll show you today's time, um, GPS fix, miles per hour your average speed, distance traveled, uh, total time traveled, and a compass. So if you don't like uh, how either of those two look, the uh, digital dashboard or classic navigation, you can uh, tweak the way, the way they look by tapping this little arrow key. And clicking on edit and you can move stuff around or add different parts to it or you can uh, make a completely new one from scratch by pressing this plus button and you have a grid of squares it's um, 16 wide by 8 tall and then just swipe up on this panel and it'll show you all the different parts that you can put onto it uh, it'll show you uh, what they what information they show along with the size. So let's go ahead and try making one. And once you put the part on there, just press the check mark. And you can swipe up and down to see more parts.
Right, and once you're done, you can uh, save it by pressing this little disc. And you should see it in the main menu. And also, if you have places, uh, if you type places into the app before, you don't have to retype them in every time. They should be saved uh, in this places menu. And now you have your own customized HUD that you can use for your car. So once you're done making a, either selecting one of the two pre-built ones or making your own, um, before you put it onto your dashboard, you're going to want to do HUD switch. Just tap to bring up these uh, options in the top right. And then pressing HUD switch will reverse the image so that when you reflect it onto your windshield it'll show up the right way and you can read it also these options can uh, toggle the grid on and off you can also change the color uh, I like sky blue there's also orange, red, yellow, green and speed units toggle between kilometers per hour and miles per hour so here's a little demonstration of the app so you guys can see what it looks like. This is the HUD that I custom built showing speed and navigation directions. The speedometer is very accurate. It's right on par with the speedometer in my car. And you'll see directions just pop up every time I need to make a turn. So overall this is a very cool app. It's a great way to show off your next 7 to your friends. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And check out the full tutorial at Nexus 7 Softmodder.